Your incline dumbbell curls are quite a hard variation of um, any bicep exercise. We're going to be at an incline, so have your bench at about 30, oh, probably closer to 45 degrees, like this bench here. Don't have it any lower than that, and too high up, it's probably it's going to be too easy and too much like a standing or a standard seated uh, bicep curl. <clears throat> Pick up the dumbbells. We're going to start off with a neutral grip incline dumbbell curl. Coming back like so. Head against the bench. Now keeping your upper arms still, we're going to curl up using a neutral grip and curl all the way back down. Notice here how my elbows aren't moving. As soon as you start moving your elbows, you're going to start using the shoulders instead. Okay, breathe in on the way down, breathe out on the way back up. That's the neutral grip. We'll now go to a standard curl where your palms are facing forward. Again, Keep your elbows from moving, keep them nice and still, come all the way down, and curl right up. Breathe out on the way up, breathe in as you come back down. And now we'll do a twisting version. You start with a neutral grip, and then you twist up into your standard dumbbell curl, like so. Breathe out, and then breathe in as you come back down. The twist should be a gradual twist. You can also do these alternating, and by doing so, you start with one arm, breathe out, Breathe in, and then when that arm's finished, go on to the next arm. Breathe out, and then breathe in. This is quite a different stimulus to standing or um, sitting down, so it, it will stimulate uh, muscle growth through, through the bicep quite effectively by changing your workout up a bit.